I'll read you, beautiful beaver babies, and welcome to another episode of, of James has to adjust the mic a little bit. Uh, Jurassic World Alive! And wow, okay, so last video, I said that we were going to work towards some of the unique creatures, some of the new unique creatures that have came out recently. Um, and we have some unlocked, actually. Yeah. Now on Friday, the previous Friday, or well, Fridays generally, uh, is where you're supposed to be able to dart con a Taurus. Now, unfortunately, I found about five Carnotauruses, and I did go out and about. Um, they seem to, for me, only be in certain areas. I was like, oh, this bit, this place again, there's Carnos here. But I didn't really go out my way because I'm, let's say, very far off getting the Indotaurus. However, um, I've heard that the Indotaurus is very, very good very good and can deal like a, a, a made like thousands upon thousands of damage to um like mortem wrecks or something there's a certain strat that does it we not only have we got a unique unlocked and i think i'm working my way towards another unique um we have a boss an apex unlock can you guess what it is uh, you probably can, but we're about to go and find it. That is, it is, I, 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 I unlocked it last week, actually. Um, and I was like, eh, I'll wait till next week. <laughs> it's Monday, so we're going to see a lot of news come through. So first off, this is the new hybrid. Now, people are already apparently asking for it to be nerfed because it's too powerful. So uh, I deliberately haven't unlocked it because I waited for you guys. I wanted you here. That's right, you. Specifically. Uh, you know who you are. <laughs> so this is the Ford Rex. Um, it is the Draco Rex Gen 2 and the uh, Phosphorus, I think it is, uh, or the hybrid. Um, now, what I have been doing is putting my iPad at the side, setting off a Giga Scent and working or doing something else. Mainly playing Horizon Zero Dawn because that's a really good game and I want to get prepared for the sequel. Um, but every time a Draco Rex comes up, Give it a dart. And as you can see, we have 33,000. Oh, yes. Uh, DNA. So here we go. This is the new hybrid, the Fofarahax. So if you remember the last one, uh, its hybrid or its its parent, the Phosphosaura, had seen a lot of play. Uh, not recently, but before, because it was really quick, 130 base speed. Um, and, you know, you level it up to max level. And it basically has a priority move right off the bat, which is instant rampage. So whatever attack it is, double, basically. And it has the chance of swapping in and stunning something, as well as being swap prevention. Uh, you can't you can't stop it from swapping, which is great because what normally people would do is they would go for instant rampage, delayed rampage and run and get the heck out of dodge before they get killed because this thing's kind of a glass cannon. Uh, downside, no, you know, no crit chances, no armor. And that's really, this is a complete glass cannon. Um, however, I'm wanting to see what it's hybrid has. So it's a little bit slower, just a little bit. Um, you know, it has more chance for a crit, which is great. Now, let's have a look at these. So a daring strike self cleanses damage over time. Very good. Uh, target lower HP. Okay, well, whatever. Attack 100, 100, 1,253. Bypassing armor. Great. Reduces damage for two attacks. Brilliant. Lasting one turn. Okay, I mean, two attacks, that's only really going to benefit a raid. Uh, critical sidestep. This is good. So normally, a sidestep will give you a dodge and uh, a speed increase. This one gives you a speed increase, uh, lasting two turns, a crit increase, and a dodge. A 100% chance to dodge. So if you're not faster right away, you can go for this, get a 10% increase to speed and crit chance, which, I mean, your crit chance goes up 100%. So your next hit will be a critical hit. That's killer. <laughs> uh, it's cautious cutting rampage, which you can go for first. Also cleanses damage over time. Um, and does double the damage, I think. I think that's double the damage. And 50% of the opponent's attack. Now, what's really good about this is what we're about to get into here. The lethal rampage. So, not only do you do double damage, a bit like the last one, but you go through block, like any shields, invincibilities, and armor. And um, you also damage the opponent a lot in bleed. Oh, three, point, point 0.34, which is more than a third, which lasts for two turns. So you're going to do over 60% damage 
So you're in a good chance. You're in a good standing there. Also, alert rending lockdown. This is if it's swapped in. So if it's health above half or whatever, um, it does this. What was it? Targets HP swap prevent lasting two turns. So it so stops them from swapping and also deals a quarter rending damage. Now, it's not armor piercing, but it's still pretty decent. Uh, if it's threatened, however... Um, it only does 20% HP damage, but uh, I think it still swaps, swaps uh, sorry, if I can even talk, stops them from swapping. Unable to swap, lasting two turns, or at least I have no idea. Maybe this has stopped them from swapping. So either way, if they swap out, you're going to do damage. We'll find out because we're going to use it. Uh, stunning obs obstruction. Escapee. Ah, so there you go. So that's if you swap. And this is if somebody else escapes. Swap prevent to so stop them from swapping. And you do so much damage. And you've got a 100% chance to stun them. So if they, if they try and swap out, even, even if they do get to swap out, you do attack to them and you stun them. Weird. You're just guaranteeing them to get a you, you get a free hit next turn. Now, this is where it's make or break, really. Resistances. 75% chance to stun. It's okay. It's it's not OP. A lot of creatures have 100 percent But I'll take it. 50% swap prevention. Okay, so it can be swap prevented. The the other one couldn't. This one can. And it's got a speed decrease of 50% resistance. It's it's resistance aren't as good as its parent, if I'm gonna be honest. Let's have a look. Um where you are 100% swap prevention and 75% chance. So you've basically taken the swap prevention, split it in two, and then said, okay, well, 50% swap prevention, but we also get 50% speed reduction prevention. So, I mean, it's really up to you. But I've been done for a long time for this specific reason. Oh, I can't even get 20 fuses. Well, well, the thing is, right, this game... You, oh, was that five? Oh, brilliant. Oh, well, there we go. We got level 21. Let's keep on fusing, see what we get here. So we can do another one. We can do two more of these. We can do... Oh, 50. Heck yeah. Nice. Takes us to 290. So we're definitely level 23, I think, at this point. And one more. Oh, another 50. Another, another 130. That takes us to 420. So maybe level 24. The, the problem is you can't just have one of these new hybrids and put it in your team right away. Especially without boosts, because it will get shredded. Unless it's something that, like this, doesn't really rely on speed. It's got a priority move, and it can get out, and it does rend. So its its, it's abilities make up for it not being boosted, if you know what I mean. Uh, so is there... Oh, we probably can get one more fuse on it, but we do need to level it up if that is the case. So I'm going to quickly go through into uh, anything that I might have asked for. I think I might have asked for Draco. Oh no, it was glipped on, that's right, because there's another hybrid that we're hopefully going to unlock in this video. Um, I don't think I got any more uh, Draco Rexes. No, I didn't. Okay, let's have a look. Ha ha! No, we did! Because if we go into Alliance, as you can see, Exploration is second best uh, incubator, the second highest. And you know why that was? Because everybody was darting, because they wanted the Draco Rex, they wanted Carnotaurus, and even the prize for this was Draco Rex DNA. So, I mean, that's what we want, I, I guess, in a way. Like, I sort of was a bit annoyed at Ludia for making, you know, the new hybrids stuff we've already got and already used, but also it makes people want to dart. So I get it. I do. I just don't like it. <laughs> so let's open up the best incubator, well, or the second best incubator. Uh, 2,571 of that. Brilliant. We're just 100 nod off of a Draco of another pop of it. So some Streety Myamas, but really, uh, what's the, what is it? Myasaura. Okay, not too bad, not too bad. And this one, let's have a look what we got. Uh, a Patasaur, Bront, Ethereum. Uh, just, it sounds like that's a blooming Bitcoin, isn't it? Ethereum or something like that. And what is the epic? Epic. It was a legend. It's epic. Bragiosaur. Bragiosaurus. Right. Also, I committed a cardinal sin and I forgot to dart the unique <laughs> for last week, the Sunday. However, it wasn't too bad because it was Smile and Emma's, which I don't want to use really. Um, and the super evil fluffy fluffy thing, which... I'm not even really asked about either. So if it was a constrictor bow or whatever it is, I might have been a bit annoyed with myself. I'm annoyed with myself anyway, because hate's unique DNA and that's hard to come by. 
but I did dot all the Archaeopteryxes before that I wanted to and all of the lizard things. So I'm, I'm not too fussed about that. So let's quickly jump back into this. And this is the bad boy. Oh, yes, the Referantum, which I've already got 305 of. So let's have a look at this. We've unlocked one of the Apexes and pretty darn quickly, actually. Um, I think... I mean, I'm a week behind, so I should have unlocked this last week, but I, I completely forgot about it. Uh, so let's have a look at this guy. So already level 26, can be used. 105 speed, it's pretty quick. 160, or well, sorry, 1,600 attack and 4,200 health. So it's got a lot. I'd love to see what builds we can do with this. So you've got Cunning Strike. Eh, I'm not really too fussed about that. Alert Notification. Okay, some extra things there. Cunning Rampage. Not too bad. And Super Distraction. A Super... Di hold on. Hold on. We need a Super Distraction. Yeah, there you go. Uh, so highest damage. Remove Dodge. Very good. 25% uh, chance of stun. Damage over time as well. Um, and reduce damage for 50%. And that... I mean, it is a delay of one, but you get a swap in distraction, which is good, and alert counter distraction. So if your HP is over uh, 2,000, attacker after receiving and surviving damage, reduce damage 10% for four attack. Whew. Is that just generally after every hit? The alert counter distraction? I think that is after every hit. You reduce damage by 10% for four attacks, lasting two turns. Ooh, but it's got no way of healing itself. Interesting, because that would be good if it could heal itself. Stun, rend, reduce damage, damage over time, a vulnerable and crit reduction. Ugh, who cares about that? <laughs> I mean, what is its crit chance anyway? Pretty high? 10%. Oh, yay, my 10% crit reduction is not going to be reduced anymore. <laughs> cares about that honestly okay well we got it we got it do we need to use it i don't know okay so the other hybrid even though like the, i forgot to mention this last video and i know it must it's infuriating for me to watch this because i always go i lose my train of thought and i meant to talk about this in the last video this guy the glyptoceras so there has been a lot of dinosaurs that have just got new like the dinosaurs have just been added into the game and now they've got like good hybrids i Oh god, look at that chin on it. Wow. Ooh, that is a, that's a look at. Uh, <laughs> but I don't know how anyone's got this or not. Like a level 15 for this already? Where'd you find this? Where'd you bump into this? I very rarely bump into it at all. What does it say? North America, South America all the time. Wait. They've actually geolocked it? What? So no wonder I don't bump into it. Is that, okay, I've got to check the other dinosaurs. There's got to be other ones that are geolocked that I don't even know about. Oh, there you go. Struthiomimus is map all the time. Sorry, Europe all the time. So there you go. That's where I got 4,000 of this thing and then none of the other thing. But I don't know. Does this have a hybrid? No. Immune to stun, immune to attack, immune to crit, and pretty good against swap. Ooh, when, if that has a hybrid already, that's going to be really good. And it will probably get one eventually with those stats. Jesus. I mean, I, I when this game was first launched, I thought that would be a fun idea. Like, you could only get Utah Raptor in Utah. How cool would that be? Because then you'd want to travel. But now it's like, oh, great. I can't get that hybrid. And if it gets a good, unique hybrid behind it, like, I'm only going to be able to get that dinosaur's DNA on freaking Sundays when I can ask for it. And that's it. I get Pokemon Go doing it. But with this, you need them to make better things. Like, yeah, sure enough, you can only get Taurus in America, but who's using Taurus in a, in a gym battle or something like that? Whereas this, maybe I want to use that. Maybe there's a good one for each region. I don't know. Uh, Andrew Top, so this is the one that I was wanting. So let's unlock this guy. Apparently, this one's pretty good too. Don't really know too much about it. Um, but I do have a lot of Glyptodon and I think it's Andrew. Um, the Andrew, Andrew Sukus, Andrew Sarkus, that one, the one that's a relative of a whale. Uh, yes, I've pumped into those loads of times. So we can get 20 of them. Oh God, they're all, no, nothing good. Oh, that was not good at all. Oh dear. Right, well, at least we can keep on going with this. It's glipped it on I run out of, not the, uh, not Andrew, Andrew Sarkus. I can set up a Giga Send and get Andrew Sarkus all blooming day. And, oh, that's unfortunate. Where, what? What, 58 away from another pop? Oh, damn it! 
58, why? Uh, unless I go my map now. Although, I think Draco Rex is appearing uh, in the... Um... Oh, there he is. Look at him. He's hiding. Yeah, cheeky. Get your ass, saw you. Okay, so there you go. We we've got another thousand pop on it. And hopefully, we can unlock the Andrew tops. Um, I'm hoping that people aren't thinking that the... Oh, because I've heard the Andrew hybrid is good. And I hope they mean the unique hybrid and not the legendary hybrid, which is what I'm getting right now. Because the Argentavis's epic hybrid is actually really good. And I mean really good. I was quite surprised by it, actually. We got sun coming in. Am I going to have to close that blind? There we go. Oh, I just wiped myself on the box of paints while I don't Yes, that's how we do it. Okay, do we have another Glyptodon? Oh, he's out of range. Look how common those are. Glyptodons everywhere. Is this guy a, a rarity? 80,000. Uh, you know what? I'm going to dart this because it's 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 80,000. It's a common. We can pretty much rip through that within two seconds. So we're not going to worry about that. Um, but I will admit, because of this update and because of the new hybrids, I have been playing Jurassic World Alive more than I have ever played it. Uh, even when it first came out, I felt like. Because um, it's it's almost always on. <laughs> it's always, almost always just playing somewhere like I'm I'm just I'm editing or I'm, like I said, playing Horizon Zero Dawn with Whitney. And it's just there. So I just look over it, glance at it. Is it an epic? No. Is it a Dracorex? No. Unfortunately, this iPad is really good at holding its battery, so it doesn't actually die. So all I'll do is I'll put out a good consent because I'll, I'll use that when I'm editing this video later. I wasn't lying, you know. Ooh, more Glyptodon, please. Yes. Give me, give me, give me, give me, give me. There you go. And we have a Eudemorphodon. Not bad, not bad. We'll go, we'll go dot that. And then we'll make or see how many levels we can get up with the Dracorex hybrid. Um, and Draco Rex, I'm glad that now it's part of the, um, you know, it's in the supply drops because I felt like maybe it was supposed to be quite common. However, when I do the Giga Scent, I don't really bump into too many of them. Oh, don't you love it when like it's just all down the middle on the body shots on this thing? I mean, yeah, I, I got a few solid hits there. Three into one is pretty good, I'd say. The best one to dart, my favorite to dart is the Megaloceros, the deer. I can almost get 100% direct hits on that thing because it just it stays in the middle and just goes, <laughs> it doesn't move. None of this like on the leg with the Myasaur or whatever. That garbage. No, oh, look, oh, we got two, oh, we got Draco Rex and a Glyptodon and a Glyptodon. Oh, I like this. So it is a bit of a shame that I'm not going to be unlocking the Inner Taurus for a while. Um, but I mean, it. I'll definitely showcase it in the video. I'm sure one of the people I raid with um, has already unlocked it. In fact, I know somebody on my alliance has unlocked it. So I'd love to see what kind of damage it can deal to a boss. Because I've seen some screenshots. And it looks like it can kill a Mormorex in almost one hit. And I don't know how that's possible. I assume we just get the crit chance up and then just get loads of attack up on it as well. So there's a Glyptodon sniffing the uh, Sarko's bottom there. Lovely, lovely, jubbly. And I do have the VIP as well, which means that I would, I am able to dart this. Otherwise, it would have been out of range. And I don't know if many people get VIP. Um, I mean, originally I got VIP because <sighs> this is my business. I play it because I enjoy it, but because... Because it's, you know, my YouTube channel and my business is a YouTube channel, I can write it off as a business expense, which is brilliant. So it really, it just allows me to go, right, what's dinosaur related? I can put on the channel that I can spend money on. But however, I don't abuse it because I don't go crazy in this game. I could, but then what's the point? Because <laughs> it just it just defeats the point of it. I feel the fun's gone when I've just got a million bucks and I speed everything. I'm saying that, though, it would be nice to have some boost, but I'm not going to fall for it. I'm not doing it. I'm not doing it, all right? We've got morals and something, a conscience. I don't know. Anyway, let's have a look at what this tournament as well before we do. I know we'll get there eventually. We'll uh, level up the Draco Rex hybrid, and we need to go over the things that we've got coming up as well. Link in the description below. Collect your books you're welcome uh so this was my team yeah this guy the argentavis uh hybrid so well i didn't do too much i got the things i mean it's coin i'm not really fussed about coin i mean coin is you know really good but at the same time i wasn't really that fussed Eight thousand coin is better than nothing and i was doing other things like darting draco rex skilled like darius oh a camp cretaceous thing very nice also i will admit we'll have a look at it actually i'll, I'll save it for a battle i did buy something and it was an emote and 
I think it's a good emote. I think it just trumps anything that, that can happen. Uh, you know, that laughing, crying. If you've got that laughing, crying, Mr. DNA emote, sod you. I hate you. <laughs> oh, the only people who have that are asses, in my personal opinion. Because um, they only do it when they're winning or, you know, if something goes wrong, they laugh at you. It's like... I mean, the best thing is the yawn. Oh, it's yawn, isn't it? Yawn. Mm, yawn was the worst, I suppose. Yawn, yawn and the laughing one are pretty bad. Okay, so let's have a look. Where did we unlock this thing? Uh, actually, you know what it is? Before we do that, I want to see if we can actually unlock this Andrew Tops. If we do unlock it, that'll be the bare minimum I can do. I will definitely not be able to level it up. There's another hybrid there. I don't know what that is. Uh, so we'll do a couple more fuses. I think we can do, yep, a thousand. There you go. Oh, come on. Ugh, 80. 80, at least it's over 800, I suppose. We'll get there. What is this guy? Like, what is his stats? 25%. It's not got great speed, though. Um, the rendering, rending takedown's pretty good. No escape's good. Exposing count is good. Speed decrease is good. Uh, there's a lot, there's a lot of stuff going for it. Okay, we can go for a couple more fuses here. Why couldn't I have got five of those? I mean, if we lived in a, a world where we could see other timelines and see what happened, I'd love to see if I just clicked it single. I mean, it's randomly generated, isn't it? It doesn't make a difference. If I do it, you know, instead of doing 10, just doing 10 separate ones, if that was actually better. I don't know. I don't know. There's no way to test that theory, unfortunately. Remember when we used to do the animations and we used to click on it when it was like doing the animation? Like, ah, I got 100 there. See, it works. <laughs> I remember going to Ludia and telling them that. Or they said, they mentioned it and they were like, you we're starting to believe it was real. <laughs> Imagine that, you make the game like, wait, is it? <laughs> okay, so we got three left. Let's have a look. Let's have a look. 40. Good, good, good. 120. I, we need 100 here. We need 100 and then something crazy. It's not going to happen. Right, we need 110. It's definitely not going to happen, but we're getting close. Maybe next time. I mean, Glyptodon's quite a rarity to come by. I guess I'd have to wake up. I suppose, and see the day. But you don't like to do that. I don't want to do that. No, you can't make me. <laughs> okay, so that that's that done. We, we, we're pretty close to that one. Right, let's go to the top and get this new hybrid. All right, fusions. All right, okay, that's the best we can do. So we've got 420, 60,000. It's going to cost me a lot of coin to get this higher. But I do want to use them. I, I mean, I, I'll swip, sw swip him, I'll swap him in for a battle. 70,000 there. Ooh, 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 I don't like it. Oh, we're a little, well, I think we'll be able to get it. I think we'll be able to get it here. Uh, we got three pops. Yep, that's it, guaranteed. And on a 30, we got it. Brilliant. Okay. So we're getting to level 24. How much is that going to cost me? 80. Oh, 80,000. I don't like it. No. Um, so level 24. Uh, you know what? Yeah, let's do let's do two more fuses. Maybe we'll get a hundred. Oh, oh, a fifty. Very good. One fifth of what we need. Let's go again. Shut. Look at my coin. Oh my god, the coin. And sounds about right. Sounds about right. Okay, so let's see. You would have jumped up now. There you are. Right. What can we swap you out for? For a tester. Let's swap you out from the for the deer. Let's see. Okay. So why don't we jump to? What's coming up this week, shall we? Alrighty ho, welcome to the news studio. So, from Monday to Tuesday, you have Irritated Gen 2, Allosaurus, Sarkosuchus, yes, and Dracorex Gen 2. Out of those, the beaver pick has to be, of course, Irritated Gen 2. No, no, it's it's Dracorex Gen 2. Like, why would you pick anything else? I mean, you could pick Sarko, I suppose, or Allo, depending on what you're going for, but... Draker X Gen 2 has a lot of hybrids now, apparently, and you want to go for that one. Uh, unfortunately, unlike the last week, uh, which you could get legendaries and uniques, which I didn't do it, uh, Wednesday to Friday is all rares, and it's 18 attempts, which is normal. Uh, so you've got T-Rex Gen 2, Albertosaurus, and Gorgosaurus. Out of those, I think Gorgosaur, if you're going for the Scorpius Rex, I think you need Gorgosaur. Is it? I don't know. You need it for something. And Albertosaur is pretty decent. Now, those, I'd probably pick Albertosaur unless you're going for Tenoto Rex, which I think is T-Rex Gen 2. And on Saturday to Sunday, we have Acrocanthosaurus, Allosaur Gen 2, and the classic T-Rex. Out of those, probably Acrocanthosaurus. I think that does have a hybrid that's quite hard to come by. At least I don't have it. I'm not getting it anyway. Um, so I'd probably go for Al uh, Acrocanthosaurus because T-Rex. The thing is, even if you get a T-Rex level 30... 
it's not the best. <laughs> even a level 30 with all its boosts. It's like, it can be easy as like attack reduce. So it's not even good for the skill tournaments. Because I got one level 26. And I very rarely see it win any battles uh, of note. Uh, other things to note through this week. Uh, on Tuesday, we've got a boost incubator for attack. On Thursday, a health incubator. And on Friday, a speed incubator. Also on the Friday, an Indominus Rex Gen 2 incubator an epic incubator um and on the wednesday we've got a day docorous rare incubator and on the sunday it's chasing the cash the going the, the going the coin that's it words james uh which is will allow you to get like twenty five thousand coin pretty easy or like 250 000, something like that and on the saturday you've also got an emote to win i think that's what that means it looks like mr dna's eyebrows and eyes I think that's what that is. So it means we're probably going to get an emo if you do that. Um, but yeah, there you go. Back to battle, shall we? Gyrosphere Kingdom. Let's go. What will we get? Come on, please pull it. Please pull it. Ah, you buggy. <laughs> all right, all right. Let's do a regular battle then, I suppose. Oh, God. Oh, God. It's a Mammalania. Oh, Lord. Um, Is that... Uh, I guess that's not too bad. I suppose we can do a big chunk of damage to it. Oh, he's swapping already. He was not happy with that matchup at all. Goes for his Mono Rhino. Level 30. Has crazy stats. And will it stun? Of course it will. Didn't even look at it. But it did. Of course it did. You know what they should put in? Is a surrender. They should put a surrender button in. That would be great. So do you think he's going to go for shield? Honestly, whatever I choose, he will choose the opposite and it'll be correct for him. If I go for resilient, he'll go for shield. If I go for big hit, he'll go for... Uh, but... Ah! I knew it! I knew it! it it's always the wrong one. I could have just went for the biggest hit. I, it's, 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 it's like they know. They know. I thought he would go for the damage reduction just to get half the... Now watch. Now he'll go for the, the reduce my attack. Yeah! I don't know what it is. Just, I'm incredibly unlucky when it comes to this. I mean, I could have done loads of damage to him there. Absolutely loads of damage. In fact, he would almost be dead now. In fact, he probably would have been dead. I don't know. Very close. But seeing as we've got our own model of Rhino, it's like, why not? He's probably going to go for a hit here and he can... Oh, he can't kill me. Ooh, is he going to save it? Let's have a look. Now, he was faster, which means I think if he swapped, he would have swapped out right there. Yes, okay. So, well, we've killed it. We got rid of it. My thoughts are he might have a Sino. If he's, if he's willing to fodder this off, he's probably got a Sino. <laughs> Whoa, do we bear that in mind? I don't know. I don't know, man. Um, I mean, we've got a Morton that's faster here. If we get this correct, um, he's got a Mammalania, which is also a bad matchup against a Mortem. So he hasn't got so he hasn't got good dinosaurs here for a mortem, and my mortem's faster than this, which I'm really surprised because again, I still haven't um, done any of the uh, things that I wanted to do to mortem, like take off the attack and put it more on speed or health or something. It's still got max attack, um, so this will be uh, Healy, which will come through. Um, I'm assuming it'll be Healy, even though I can't kill him. He could just go for a big hit here. But he, he opts for this, which I guess isn't too bad. Um, we'll see. We'll see. I'm kind of happy. Unless he's got a Sino, which he might be trying to... I call, I call it Sino. It's, it's a Ceramagnus, right? It's a Sino. It's got one horn. It's a giant boss Sino. So now he'll go for the Rampage. And he's, he's really whittling me down to the point where a Sino or a Ceramagnus could swap in and kill me. That's what he's hoping for here. Um, now, you might have a heal. No, is it a Sino? Oh, it's an Indo. A uh, Scorpius Rex. <laughs> There's too many hybrids, man. There's too many hybrids. Okay, okay. I like it. I like it. I mean, he's probably going to go for just a regular hit to kill me here, I think. He's just going to go for regular bite because it can break through my block and kill me. So, you know what? He doesn't realize I have my own Scorpius and I'm going to use my Scorpius. Um, and he's... I would say that's what he's going to do. He's going to go for that. Now, level 30, 165 speed, 163 speed. Oh, he's put it all on attack, I think. Yeah. I'm, I'm Unfortunately for him, um, he did get a crit. It didn't go through. But he's also slower, um, which actually might work for him. If, if he goes for the damage reduction here. Oh, it didn't go through the dodge. What's he going to do? Is he going to go for quills? Oh, he didn't. Oh, that's that's actually not too great for him. 
Um, because I think I've still got my dodge. No, I don't. Oh, it went through dodge. Never mind. Okay. Yeah, I thought he'd do that. I guess that's okay. Um, ooh, ooh. Either way, one of us is going to die and the other one's not got much health left. There's a chance here I could go through um, and kill him here. I think, I think. No, there's not, because I, I did go through and I didn't kill him. Right, now what do we do here is the question. Um, do we swap in for the... He's going to go for the quills. That's what he's... He's going to go for the quills. So sod it. Hopefully we go through the block here. Um, I think we may be able to just kill him, even if we don't. Ah, damn it. Ah, well, either way, he's going to go for the quills. Yeah, that's the that's the best thing he could do. He didn't get the crit because he has no crit chance. Right, so it's 1-1. One, one. It's 1-1, one, one, and it is a close game. A very, very close game. So what's his attack? Ooh, it's it's very high. It is very high. Um, so I'm gonna. He does. My Mortem can really finish him off here, because uh, he's got the Mammalania and he's got the Hadrosaur. That's it. That's all he's got is those. Um, and if my Mortem goes out, I'm faster than the Hadrosaur looks. It's just the Mammalania that might be an issue because he could go for the single hit and then go for the Resilient Rampage and maybe kill me. Um, it's a tough one. I want to survive this. I really do. I've reduced his attack and I've got a dodge. I even reduce attack. I think he might be able to kill me if he gets through the dodge. Oh, there we go. Okay. Okay. Here it is. Here it is. Um, so what's the best thing he could do? Mammalania? Really? That's the best he can do? I think we've won. That's it. He's got Mammalania or Hadrosaur. He's probably not going to put Hadrosaur in. He's, yeah, there's the Mammalania. Now, Mammalania, I think, is weak to bleed, which it is. And we may as well do it because it's... Oh, and a crit! Oh, it's not looking good. It's really not looking good for him. Yes, he is digging, but... He doesn't realize that I got a Mortem and it's going to really hurt him here. Um, yeah, he's dead. That's it. There's nothing he can do here. Uh, he, ha he can go for 4,800... And he has a 5% chance to get a crit. Maybe if he gets a crit, he could kill me. If he gets a crit, he could kill me. However, chances of that, very low. And it would have been that off. And there it is. There it is. Well, there was a battle. No dra- Okay, we're just going to keep on drawing until we get this dinosaur creature hybrid thing. Not bad. Had to work for that one. Bloody hell. <laughs> hey, there we go. Right, so it's definitely something we want to swap in. Um, although we also want to survive, which is very important. So I, it's kind of an awkward situation with this because I've got a lot of swapperinis. And actually, that's not too bad. He will go for a shield here. So, and his render. He's no reduction to render, does he? Okay, he'll go for a shield. I mean, that's just what you've got to do with a Dio. You want that counter. That's what you're going to do. It would be great if I had Scorpius Rex, and I could have swapped you to it. But you know what? I'd rather take this counter, uh, go for a shield here. This is the big brain play here. Now he's going to go for the biggest hit and do a lot of damage. Let's be fair. It's going to gonna hurt quite a bit. Um, and now he's going to go for the instant invincibility. Um, either that or he's going to swap it a Sino. Um, and I don't mind that at all because I will swap to Scorp. In fact, the fact that he that turn went so quick means he's went for invincibility or he swapped. And he's went for invincibility, I'm going to say. Hopefully, that's what he's done. I think he's went for invincibility here. Come on. Come on. Yes! <laughs> Suck it! <laughs> you ready for the emote? I'm going to lose this because I'm going to do it. But hey-ho, there you go, some popcorn! Woo! <laughs> if anybody laughs at points for you, popcorn's the way to go. Okay, oh! Interesting. Now, Scorpius Rex v Scorpius Rex isn't a really good matchup, especially if you're second, um, I think. Oh, sorry, especially if you swap into a Scorpius Rex. It's already had its stuff. Uh, so he's definitely going to get hit. He does luckily get the dodge. However, the bleed's about to come through. The bleed isn't very good for him. Uh, now he cannot do anything. He can go for his... He's actually quicker as well. This is the worst that could have happened to him because now he's going to go for his own Toxic and Quills. Uh, doesn't get through my dodge. And also, I'm going to cleanse myself of it here. Um, however, he is dead because he's about to be hit by his, the bleed I inflicted. 
and this, which might go through his block. Yeah, he's dead. And you never swap a Scorpius Rex Gen 3 into a Scorpius Rex Gen 3 for this very reason. Um, especially if you end up being faster. <laughs> um, okay, so he's probably going to go for... I mean, I think he's even quicker than me here. So is it re any rend resistance? It's not rend resistance, but it will kill me in one hit here. Um, I think I'm going to go for Sino because I've got a lot of swaps. I want to save this guy. Um, I can also... Yeah, yeah, I'm okay. I'm okay. I've got the bird. I want the bird to get this kill. That's what I want. I want the bird to get the kill. So that was his biggest hit. Um, he can go for the revenge distraction. Um, and he might do that. And if he does do that, I'm just going to cleanse myself. What's my armor? 25%. Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to do that. Yeah. Hopefully, if he gets a crit, he's killed me. If he doesn't... I've survived. Yeah. Okay, good, 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 good. Good, 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 good. Okay, here we go. And bam! Now he's in a bad situation. Uh, unfortunately, he's still quicker than me. Oh, it's no speed reduce anymore, is it? Okay, so the swap is a deer. Well done, well done. You got your deal. Unfortunately, I do my Scorpius Rex again, and I'm going to tox it and bleed you here. And you might be stunned. And you won't like that. I could have big brained him and tried to go on for the thing, but I'm okay. Um, so here, um, what do we do? Do you think we just put in uh, the, the Scorpius? I mean, he might just go sod it. I'm going to go for a big hit. And maybe that's what he's going to do. If I was him, I would now just be like, you know what? I might survive this, and I might also not be stunned, and I could kill him. Yeah, and that's what he's gone for. He's gone for the regular hit. Will he get stunned? Ah, that's unlucky. That's unlucky. He did try it. He did try it. He knew he was going to die here either way. Um, but he could have killed me. He could have killed me. Um, I don't, maybe he cleanses himself? I don't know. Okay, in comes this guy, and you know who's gonna get the kill? The Fosfor- whatever it's called, this thing gets the kill! The rendering lockdown, bam, and it wins! Woo, can we get a- Yeah! Oh, what are we doing? That's it, there we go. <laughs> hey, he gets it! Wow, 3-1 against another swap in. That's what this meta is. It's just a swap in meta. How many things can you put in the game to do damage, basically, as soon as you're swapping? And there you have it, guys. If you enjoyed this video, leave a like. Again, don't forget to use the link down below because, you know, you get free books. And who doesn't like free books? And until next time, I'll see you, cutie beaver babies, later. Bye <laughs> bye.